Nurses in New York say there's still plenty of work to be done. Kayla Solomon talked to one Georgia nurse who says the fight against COVID-19 continues. It, it feels weird seeing the streets so empty. That's how Milledgeville native Arlene Simmons describes the streets of New York, but the hospitals are a different story. Cold blues all day, crash carts sitting outside of the doors, just ready. Uh, everyone is running all day in a given time. Simmons has been hustling around a New York hospital for almost a month now. And she says, although there's a slow decline in deaths, it's still here. hectic. When we would get off work, there would be lines of people with pictures of their loved ones just asking, have we seen them? Do we know anything about them? Uh, now the lines are shorter. This week, Simmons posted a video showing some of her experiences and even a glimpse into what her morning drives look like. Um, and we all are fighting a battle. She says it was important to her to show her social media followers what it's like. I did have a duty to show some things, um, some of the things that I did encounter or some of my feelings about what I encountered. But now that she's almost at the finish line, Simmons says she can't wait to be reunited with her family. Two more weeks, <laughs> two weeks, uh, 12 hours, 35 minutes. In 12 seconds. <laughs> Before she can really be back with them, she has to quarantine for a required 14 days. In Macon, Kayla Solomon, 13 WMAZ News. Arlene says she'll continue to post what she can on social media while still working up in New York.